everyone! This is gonna be my weekly vlog number two. <laughs> Look, my henna's still on. Wow, I'm so impressed. Although, if you can see, the just part is coming off and the breathe, it's kind of hanging in there. So anyways, I'm gonna talk more about my mission trip later when I have time, but it was so awesome. Like, I really regret not going on all the mission trips since when I was younger, but it was just, it was so awesome. And so yeah, I'm gonna talk about that later because I'm about to leave, you know whatever so anyways I think I have some fun stuff coming up this week just hanging out with people so I actually have some things to vlog <laughs> so that'll be cool um on my last vlog it looked like y'all kind of liked it um maybe not I don't know but so I'm gonna plan on keep doing this I'm ready for this week so let's start it so we're in the Wendy's drive-thru and they've given us all our food but they're holding us up for our drinks that doesn't make any sense <laughs> Strawberry pasture fruit should not be that hard to make. <laughs> then we got our drinks and they forgot the straw, so I had to go inside and get them. Wendy's. Step up. And then we forgot our pool key. <laughs> Would you mind going in for it, Sarah? Yeah, I can get and it. Just bear it's mind, been a rough start. <laughs> bear in mind that Charlie's in the back end. Ah, Charlie. The escape artist. True. It's a pool day. Don't have my own pool, so you know we have the public pool, but we're chilling. So it's Tuesday and I totally haven't been vlogging at all. I'm sorry. Um, last night my friend Andrew came over and we watched The Shining. He got really scared and I was just laughing the whole time because I've already seen it. Plus I love scary movies and they don't scare me that much but he doesn't really like them. So it was a good time and my brother and him were just both like scared and I was like... It's 3 o'clock and I just got ready because I'm going to Proud Pie soon. Tomorrow I'm going to Typhoon, Texas with the church. I don't think I'll video it because it's so weird when you want to vlog but nobody else vlogs and you're like, uh, hello. Also, if you're just out talking to whatever you're talking to and then people look at you and you're like, yeah. <laughs> so I'm, I'm working on my confidence in vlogging. Also, I don't know why I'm sitting next to my Keurig, but this is my best friend. Provides for me. <laughs> It's been raining for most of today and I'm digging it. It's so pretty. I love just listening to the rain. That was really weird. Ignore that. Outfit of the day. Hi, Charlie. Okay, bye. This. Oh, what? 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 What did you say? Oh, I was thinking. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. Uh, oh, it's so pretty. Can you get in the back of your own hey, car for the aesthetic? The van train on mix Give warnings! <laughs> what? The, the one that makes me go all night long. I got on top of my Jeep so I could take a picture of the sunset. Dude, I am. It looks good. Jump. One, two, three. <laughs> Dang! She keeps yelling at us to get out of her time lapse. Oh, what are you doing? Oh. Okay. I have glitter tattoos. Mermaid. Yeah. My mom is gonna be here. And look like yeah, you'll see it later. What a cutie. Yeah, here. Happy birthday, late. She wouldn't get it on her neck though. That's the problem. I don't want it on my neck. Yeah, Zach. you do. Yeah, it's you cute. do. I just got a turtle. Yes, Mindy. I know. Fried macaroni and cheese. Oh, my favorite. Cat, what did you get? Happy birthday. I love you, Mariah. What is that? Is that what it is? All right. I'm kind of doing my thing. Birthday. Cheers. Cheers. Oh, my God. Why you gotta fight with me and cheesecake? What? You know I love to go there. See, there you go. <laughs> There's no grip on my shoes. There's definitely someone in there. Awkward, 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 awkward. <laughs> okay, Allie's definitely gonna get run over by a train, but... <laughs> There's no way I can get up there. <laughs> oh, go in. It's your size. Oh, I can't open this. 
It smells so bad back here. It really does. I can't. <laughs> There's like no way. Please don't die. Can you slide down it? Definitely not. <laughs> Go to stay up here. You do you. Oh my gosh. Look. You look your buddy. Aww. They're so cute. You're gonna get diseases, Kanan. Neck's hard. You're gonna get diseases. Other way, other way. Oh! Sort of. <laughs> so cute! Oh. I wouldn't Don't. We saw the train tracks and the rice mills, shooting pictures. Just me and the new photographer. Wow. <laughs> hey guys, it's Sunday night and I haven't had time until now to just sit down and film the end of my vlog. So that's what I'm gonna do now. Yesterday the AC in my house broke and so we were all just crammed worrying about what we're gonna do. It was really hot sleeping last night. So yeah. Without further ado, I'm gonna tell y'all what happened on my mission trip. So the junior girls and I served at the food bank in San Angelo and that was a really fun experience and we were all just hyping each other up, having fun while we were serving and we packed a lot of bags for kids who can't afford food and that was just really cool to see that we were making a difference um my brother really came to christ and grew in his faith now that we've been back from the mission trip for about a week he's been really just reading his bible getting into bible study and it's just really awesome to see on the night that all this was happening um the sermon the guy was like stand up if you want to commit your life to christ stand up if you want to just go for it in your faith and then afterwards i saw my brother and i just saw how much he was growing in God and I just burst out bawling. I was a, such a proud sister in that moment and I've never been that proud or that joyful of anything really. And that was the first time I've cried happy tears. So yeah, that was just, that was an amazing experience. And then also I was just seeing how God was working in my own life because a few years ago I was in a really bad place, which I don't wanna get into specifics or anything, but life was really rough and now I'm doing great. I'm with God. I've grown a lot in my faith and it just reminded me of his goodness and that he gives us hope. The whole week really was talking about one, we need to write, read the Bible because that's how we're going to know God's character and two, we need hope and only God can give us hope. And in Christianity, if you don't know, we believe that Jesus died on a cross so that we could be forgiven for our sins so we could have an eternal life with God in heaven. And so that means we're no longer slaves to sin which means that even though we know we've messed up, we know we make mistakes all the time, we're forgiven for it, and there is no shame or con condemnation for us, which is really awesome. We just have hope that one day we're gonna go to heaven and we're gonna live with Jesus. And it just, it gives you such a different mindset. I think they call it an eternal mindset, where I don't even know how to describe it. It's just, you know you're not just living here on earth. You're living here on earth to do all that God sent you here for. And then you're going to go to heaven and live eternity there. So, yeah. Overall, this mission trip has just really encouraged me in my faith to just keep constant in prayer and reading the Bible. And, yeah. Um, if you're not Christian, all this may sound crazy. And, yeah, but I'm happy to talk with anybody if you have any questions or just anything. I don't know. But, so, yeah, I hope what I said made sense or impacted someone and I hope y'all enjoyed my vlog for the week.